month since we saw our record breaking snow and ice event, an event that knocked out power to thousands and took out hundreds of trees. So what happens to all of those down trees? Meteorologist Jerry Neary joins us with details on that. I am so curious what happens to all these trees. Yeah, well, China, during that storm, almost 800 or almost 800 trees came crashing down. So you kind of wonder what happens to all those trees, right? Well, one company actually recycles them. Uh, they also work with the city of Portland. Sometimes the city of Portland turns those uh, trees into wood chips, but one company I found actually repurposes them into furniture. Many of us have put last month's record-breaking ice and snowstorm behind us. But one person who's going to still see what's left of the storm is Eugene Park, who's the owner of EcoPDX. Yeah, we try to do our best to work with uh, eco-friendly products. It's tucked away in the industrial area of northwest Portland where Park and some of his suppliers help him gather those down trees. We work with a lot of architecture firms, uh, general contractors. Um, we uh, design and build spaces. The process doesn't happen overnight. Uh, the recent storm, we probably won't see that wood for a few months to um, a couple years maybe. Park says it takes time to prep the wood for projects. So they need to be milled first and then um, sent to kilns or they're air dried. And at that, at that point, we would um, have access to the materials. Once Park and his team can start working on projects, they can turn just about anything into something brand new for someone. But depending on the species, it's a lot more valuable than uh, just firewood. Um, and, um, you know, using furniture or solid wood, it's something that you can appreciate for many years. Some of the wood he's recovered, he's been able to turn into beautiful pieces of furniture. This is just some of the stuff he's built over the years. A lot of it would be, um, as far as solid wood goes, it'd be um, furniture, um, reception desks, um, things like that. Many of their projects are used for anything from benches to even tabletops. Yeah, furniture for hotels, um, a lot of um, slab tables, um, dining tables, um, you know, even bathroom vanities. As long as we're still seeing active weather, many of these trees from January are going to be keeping Eugene and his team busy for years to come. The city of Portland also uses some of those downed trees for environmental restoration. That also gives some trees to the Oregon Zoo for use in animal enclosures. China, back to you. Joe, thank you.